I was 16 and was playing basketball during practice one evening and I, my foot went numb. And we spent hours that night in the ER running a battery of tests and blood work came back skewed. Very un... Very abnormal. Very abnormal. Some people, like Lindsay, were born with alphantrypsin deficiency but did not know it. Was very active, was a star athlete in high school. She had some blood tests for different reasons that were not looking for alphantrypsin. I was on call that day and I was called to to see her and, and her mother. He started talking about, I think, you know, I know what the problem is. I think you have alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency. I had a mixture of emotions. Um, <laughs> I was very sad because I was told that I couldn't play basketball anymore. <laughs> she did have a liver biopsy that confirmed that she had significant cirrhosis. Um, and I remember the, the day that we were told she had the liver biopsy and Dr. Techman came into a room and said she does have um, cirrhosis and it's pretty significant and there is no cure. So he said there is no treatment. So he said what we can offer is a liver uh, transplant if she gets to that point. So, but through the whole time he gave us hope because he kept saying, you know, he was doing research on this and he knows that there's a cure out there. He just had to find him. I feel like he's become a part of the family at this point. Um, I mean, I've known him for 18 years, so he's, he's really, I really feel like he's become part of the family.